Believe it or not, trash can be made fashionable. Ripley's Believe It or Not in Grand Prairie is making the two for a trashy runway show and Chelsea Hatchet, so to speak, joins me this morning. Good morning, a trashy runway show. That's good, I like that. <laughs> okay, so Earth Day is coming up quickly. We've been very involved in Earth Day here. Why highlight trash for a contest? Well, Ripley's Believe It or Not, we believe strongly in conservation as well as recycling and of course, anything odd, strange and weird. It's what, it's what we're known for. Okay, so. well you can call it odd, strange and weird, <laughs> but we've got some models and when I was in the green room this morning and I saw this first model walk in, I was like, that is so cute. Very so let's unique. bring her out. All right. it's Pepsi. I know, it's so great. <laughs> this dress is made out of Diet Pepsi cans, tabs, as well as her shoes plastic and the whole design was inspired by her grandmother's love of diet pepsi this so. is so cute okay can you explain to people like who designed these who made them well all of these these are all uh either recent grads or current um college students for both art institute and unt okay i love that one so far that's my favorite but we've only seen one so let's Super have the second cute. one thank you very right. much miss pepsi this okay, this is for getaway. an island getaway. Absolutely. So it's made out of um, lampshades, cords, um, some netting, and then a little bit of old clothing tied in there as well. It looks like something you would pay a lot of money for in Paris. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Super cute. All right, that's your island getaway. And our last two models, we have a pair. And they're walking a little slowly. <laughs> Well, this first dress is made out of a bunch of pleated plastic bags. That's amazing. It's absolutely amazing. It gives that vintage 1950s look, which we all love. So. That is amazing. I didn't realize until she got up close that that's what it is. It's, <laughs> it's plastic bags. Plastic bags. The brown ones, the white ones. Bottle caps for the little ensemble in the That's middle. incredible. Okay, let's look at the last one. All righty. This one is made out of, obviously, black trash bags. And her headpiece is absolutely gorgeous. It is, it's pretty. It's made out of, um, I believe, melted plastic. That is amazing. Okay, so people are gonna be able to participate in this contest. Yes. Explain yes. what's going on here, why we've had these models on TV this morning. So we're basically just trying to promote our trashy fashion and art show, of course. And it's just a really unique way for us, like I said, to talk about recycling and everything like that and just promote the artists in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Okay, so. so if people want to come out and see trashy fashion, Absolutely. when and where can they do it? It's going to be this Saturday, April 14th, and it's the event's going to be from 11 a.m. till 4 p.m. The actual fashion show itself starts promptly at noon. So. Okay, so I'm curious, how does one decide what who the winner is? What are, What's the criteria for winning? Well, you just have to have everything made out of found objects and trash, of course is the criteria and then we'll have a panel of judges judging the first second and third place winners okay and by the way they win a lot of money this is yes. not a cheap contest no, this, so to speak this is a they, they win some pretty <laughs> neat prizes so the first place winner for both the art category as well as the fashion category is going to win a thousand dollars cash so that's a pretty nice little prize. The second prize is gonna get $500, and then the third prize is gonna get 250. And all three winners from both categories are gonna have their artwork and their garments featured in our museums for a full month as one of our oddities, of course. Okay, so it may be <laughs> trashy, but it's not cheap. That's right. So tell me before we leave about the mannequin beside you. This yes. is, what is this called? So this is Mick Fashion. So this is made entirely out of everything McDonald's. Yes, those are real french fries. <laughs> Receipts, bags, everything. This was this dress was inspired from her first job at McDonald's, so very interesting. You know, some of these designers are gonna end up on the <laughs> runway in Milan or Paris. I'm convinced of it. They are great, they are so creative. And you models are beautiful, you look great in them. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you, this Thank is you. so interesting. Okay, Ripley's Trashy Art and Fashion event is Saturday, 11 to four in Grand Prairie. Go to ripleys.com slash Grand Prairie for more information.